Good morning, everybody. Right now, it is a beautifully temperate day in South Florida, actually. The sky is super blue, super hella blue. And yeah, basically, um, I'm on my way home now. I just got out of class. And I'm gonna give Shaniza something that she asked me to pick up for her. And yeah, that's basically it. And then I have to get ready so I can go to the gym because Bride is this weekend. And yeah, I'm that girl right now that is like, oh yeah, now a big important thing is coming. Now I'll start working out. All right, Cup Kids. So, um, I was supposed to go to the gym, but I ended up having like a really like bad nosebleed. And that's something that's happened to me since I was like, I, I can remember. Um, I just get nosebleed sometimes. It's just a thing that happens. So my sister was on her way. She was like, do you want to go? And I was like, no, I don't want to chance it in case I'm like running on a machine or something. And then it just starts like pouring out because it's the thing. It comes without warning. It's kind of like having menses. Um, and I completely apologize for that visual. But um, that's the truth of it. <laughs> so... I'm kind of just taking it easy now at home and I'm going to try doing some yoga later to just, you know, unwind because I'm also feeling a little, like, tight on my back. It's feel It feels a little weird. And I've been, like, stretching it out now for, like, about an hour, like, just on my bed, like, doing stuff on the computer, but, like, you know, arching my back forward. And it's actually felt, it feels a lot better. So, yeah. But, um, I'm actually going to put my culinary degree to use today and make dinner. So, I am going to attempt attempt that's really cute i can make um whatever the fuck i find in my kitchen so let's see what we are making unchopped today let's see what do we have in here a bunch of stuff we've got eggs what can we do with eggs bake a cake okay that's not dinner we have wrapped sandwiches and food okay that could come in handy as a plan b we've got um some mashed potatoes chimichurri cheese cheese Macaron mixture that's probably gone bad. Fresh face masks. Uh, beer. That could probably be something good. Okay, maybe. And... Bacon. 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 With no bacon. Okay, we can't do bacon because everybody's trying to be healthy. And cheese. Because... And uh, we can't do cheese either because people are trying to be healthy. Alright, let's see. Let's see. Hmm. Interesting. I wonder what meat we have. Because I can make a saute of something. I will figure it out. But in the meantime, I'm also going to upload the video because <laughs> I had so much fun making it yesterday that, yeah. So I think, yeah, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to try and make dinner. And then if anything fun happens or I burn my eyebrows off, you guys will be the first to know. You guys will be the first. Like, literally, I will be vlogging while I call 911. Guys, I want a waffle. I know it sounds awkward and weird and strange, but I want a waffle. I want it real bad. I want to pull a Leslie Nope and just have waffles all day. Please, can I? Can I have it? Because it sounds really delicious in theory, but then Pride is this weekend, and my waistline can't take that kind of influx of carbs all at once. So, like, I have to pretend I'm eating a waffle when I'm really eating a salad. The struggle to live up to a stereotype is real. Soup's real, guys. Soup's real. But I feel like I've just been talking about that today, so I think we're done with that for the rest of the video. Okay. Bueno. Anyways. Um. I really want a waffle. <laughs> like, in all seriousness, I want a fucking waffle. I want a waffle! But yeah. Um, I finished the potatoes. They look really good. Uh, these people came, they went to practice, and I'm here with food that's finished. So if dinner's cold and they get home, then go fuck themselves. Okay? Yeah. So, aside from that, I feel like I'm just gonna maybe drink my last cup of marshmallow macaron tea that I have left. And, um, I think I'm gonna have to go buy more. <sighs> Which means I have to go to the falls to Tivana to buy more tea. Guys, I know these are bougie white girl problems, but I have them. 
like it's a thing in my life the struggles they may not be like hella real like children not being able to find food real but like i got my own problems to deal with obviously theirs are a lot worse but mine still hurt okay they still affect me oh my god speaking of affecting me can we talk about how even like being eliminated laganja had to be a pain in the ass she was like eliminated and i was like yes thank you thank you rupaul thank you final freaking lee and then she goes and she's like i'm gonna be the first queen to chasse away and then i'm just like you look like you could have a coke like you need to have a coke because i'm done with you like i'm hella done with you and i don't understand why rupaul put you on the show maybe it was to fuck with a door maybe it's because Alyssa edwards is your drag so apparently my camera decided to die because i thought that i charged it last night but it turns out i didn't so yeah basically i'm just glad the gone just gone so anyway it's later obviously because i had to wait for this fucker to charge and yeah so the madness that has ensued since i last left you guys the potatoes came out fantastic number one they had a little too much rosemary and it needed to be tweaked a little bit uh, i'll fix them but beside the point so whatever i'm talking to abby like always and a bunch of people from work and we're all like we want to get our hands on like this limited edition shower gel and like we're like okay so let's get it let's get it and then we have to place a phone order for some reason so yeah we're placing a phone order tomorrow because i tried to do it today because you know a bitch is paranoid about it not being any left tomorrow so i was just like um i'm about to buy one like tonight online and they're like no you know just wait whatever whatever and i was like all right i'll wait <sighs> So tomorrow, that's like an Abby's hands, but there's like this mad mission, like Canada was doing one thing, and then Abby and I were like, well, when do they open? And we were like ninjas about it. She was like, okay, so someone's going to have to wake up and do it. And I was like, all right, they open at 7 Pacific Standard, so that probably means like 10 a.m. our time. So da 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 and like hashing out the details on Facebook, like obviously like not out on Facebook, just like on our page for like our staff. And I'm just like... And then Canada's like, you guys are worse than I am. And we're like, and I, I was like, I was like, girl, obviously, like, we all work together. It's like that same kind of madness. It's what bonds us. It's what makes us, like, weird together. <laughs> so, yeah. In my head, it's madness. You probably don't think, like, it's that big a deal. But I don't give a fuck. Because I'm the bitch that's getting a new shower gel that's going to smell real nice. Okay. Okay. You never want to tell me when you're recording at night. You're always pissing me off. Ugh. Well, guys, I'm going to go to bed. Because I get to sleep in tomorrow. I'm so excited. No, but really, you have no idea how excited I am. I get to sleep in tomorrow. And then I get to do whatever the hell I want. Because I am done for the week. Oh, I'm so excited. I sound so boring. And I apologize, but... Ugh. Dude, I needed this week to be over. It was just like a pain. A monumental pain in the ass. And I'm just like... All of y'all can go and fuck yourself. Okay? Ugh. But yeah. So now I'm going to go to bed because I'm going to wake up tomorrow in a fantastic mood and have a fantastic day and probably have waffles because I fucking want waffles. And I do what I want because I'm an adult. So good night y'all. Kapkunka. Namaste. And I hope you have incredibly sweet, maybe a little dirty, dreams. Bye.